Hello. It's a Monday afternoon and I've just come round to fix one or two of the pedal notes. They've been causing a bit of a, nu a nuisance recently. Some of the couplers are not as well adjusted as they should be, so I thought I'd show you what goes on with the pedal department. So here's an example of the problems we've been having. I've got the great to pedal coupler on, great open diapason on, and if I press this pedal here, I'll just press it with my hand, do you hear how the note comes in when I lean really hard on the pedal? That's because these screws here are not properly adjusted or they become unadjusted. If we just tighten that up, it should work. Voila! Amazing. Okay, and while we're here, we can just see the state of some of these um, trackers here. This looks like a bit of coat hanging that's been used to bodge together. These things are not the prettiest. There's one that's broken down here at the bottom. That's broken. That needs fixing, so I've got taken that out and I'll take it home and get some new stuff for it. That shouldn't be like that. That's been bodged. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Anyway, there we are. So here we are back at home. We've got the tracker, the broken tracker from the bottom D, which I'm hoping to play on Sunday morning. There it is, and there's the bit that's broken off. I don't know whether you can see. Let me just show you that, that the wire has just broken in two. So what we're going to do is cut a new threaded piece of wire to basically replace the broken bit. So here we are, the piece of wire in the vise thread cutter and we're just going to cut a thread on there. Just probably put some glasses on see what we'll get, what's going on. So here is now the uh, brass wire which has been bent, so I had a bent end put on it. I'm going to pop it through the hole, I don't know whether you can see in the tracker. Goes through like that. So now it's time to replace the, the binding. So you see how the rod is in place. Just need to attach some linen thread. I'm going to do it in white so you can always see which bits I've done. I'm just going to wrap that round there. So now we've put some glue on to seal the, the linen thread binding and you can see the phosphor bronze, the original it's quite a different colour from my replacement hardened brass and also my binding so you can see clearly what I've done and now what I need to do is to replace these uh, plastic buttons which uh, unfortunately once they've been on the thread won't form another thread so I've, I've actually got some leather uh, which I'm going to form a, a button to put on the end of there and to replace the bushings and then we can put it back in the organ. Well here we are back at church and uh, I'm going to fix this little tracker back into the pedal. So this is the pedal bottom D which isn't working at the moment. So now we've fixed the pedal note. Now all of this was in aid of being able to play the very last note on the piece 
I want to play on Sunday morning, which is a fugue by Bach, which ends with a pop pedal D, bottom D, and would have sounded a bit flat without the last note. So there we are, I'll just give a quick demonstration. have to put the lights on, because otherwise the electrics don't work to the pedal. So lighting will change, and I'll play the last three bars for you to be able to hear the bottom note. Thank you. 